Water Science, come on in. Put your feet up, make yourselves at home, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Jam TV. All right, my well, loves. Let's see, what do you need to know? What do you need to know? Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. I'm going to timestamp each one in the description box below. And uh, if you want to watch extended, you can purchase the extended via my website, gentvtarot.com. You'll find the link below. What do you need to know? So, Cancer, your overall vibe. Scorpio, your overall vibe. Pisces. Cancer, but you don't know. What can you do about it? And your outcome. Bottom of the deck for everyone is the Eight of Wands in reverse. So, Cancer. Just writing down your timestamp. Okay, my loves. Your overall vibe is the world reversed. Okay. That's how it goes. Ow! So, something in your life you feel like you haven't really completed, you haven't finished it. Um, like you want, I, I kind of want to say that you you want closure on this situation. Oh, you've got that itch in your back that is just in that place you can't reach. Damn. So you need closure. You feel like you want closure. Closure's not really forthcoming. Why is temperance in reverse here? Yeah. Three of cups turned the right way around there. Why is temperance here? Three of cups comes out again. Like you want closure for something. I want to say, this isn't true. This is what's going on in your head. This is not true, right? You sort of feel like they went with the better person and it sort of breaks your heart a little bit. That's not true. Who they went with was not the better person. It was the easier person to go with. I, I, I feel like there was less resistance with them than there was with you. And not that they, being with you is difficult. I kind of feel more like their life would have been hell if they hadn't gone with them. That's, it's not that you're more difficult, it's that this person is more difficult. And you feel like they weren't with the better person. But what I'm seeing here is it just made life easier for them. But you're left here heartbroken. You need closure. You don't have any closure. 
you didn't get really any answers but also you know you feel like you wanted to play this out and see where it would go it, it looked like it was going somewhere pretty good until they came in and messed it all up meddled with everything some advice here Three of Swords. I've got the Ten of Swords here as well. There is there is definitely someone else in the way. This person was the easier option. And that doesn't mean that you were more difficult. It just means that it's... I want to say the word resistance. Like, the path of least resistance. If they'd have gone with you, it would have been more difficult for them in their life so they they went with the easier option because they would have made their life hell someone else is in your way and you are not going to find peace by wanting and yearning for this you're not going to find closure and maybe you know the way that this person treated you is all the closure that you need really saying let's pull you a rune stone I've got my Palo Santo balancing on there pull you a rune stone all right plane going over F uh, wisdom I've got my cheat sheet here for um runes because I'm still learning them wisdom what are you gonna learn from this this is what I always say about relationships. When they don't work out, what did you learn from it? Sorry. Apprentice, tests, inspiration, advice. I do really feel like something's gonna come along a little later in your life where this situation that you've been through with this person you can give somebody some real good advice about it. You might end up doing what I do. I feel like doing what I do, you kind of have to walk several miles in other people's shoes. You have to have been through hellfire. You have to have been through that so that you can help other people. Just a thought. If you're considering getting some cards and learning them, I would say go for it. Conclusions are within reach. So you feel like you don't have closure right now. Closure's coming for you. Scorpio. So your overall vibe, Scorpio, is the two of wands in reverse. And uh, what you don't know is the eight of cups in reverse. You're, you're all reversed. All reverses for you. So there's a whole lot of walking away. Oh, there's endings, walking away, boundaries being set very high. I need to add some more cards to this. This is what you don't know is that they, they're not going to let you back in. They're walking away from this. You don't know that yet. They're like fully walking away from this. What can you do about it? This sort of feeling like that you have inside like a, a need for them to be in your life to be okay. That's not, you need to deal with that. 
You don't need this person back in your life to be okay. You need to deal with not feeling okay when you're not with them. I sort of feel like they might have perhaps manipulated you into believing that you need them. And now they're walking away from this. You're like <laughs> in panic. The outcome here is that you have this opportunity now. All the pain that you're going through, you are not really seeing that this is an opportunity for you. What's the word I'm looking for? You know when you like redecorate your house and uh, it was painted the wrong colour? Like maybe it was the the room was painted black this is just how i'm seeing it i gotta explain it so you get it the rooms and it's not letting any light in it's 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 not you know your style and then you decorate it in your style and it's new and it's you know it lets the light in it it feels refreshing it's almost like this is your chance to kind of do that with your life i know just go with me sometimes. I go off on these randos. Yeah. Even if I like, <laughs> literally redecorate your house. Rearrange furniture. Get your feng shui in order, mate. Put, like, the right plants in the right corner for abundance and love and, you know clear the clear the way what you don't know they're they're done they're gone they're moving on this is your chance they're not coming back What can you do? It's exactly what I'm saying. You need to let light in. Literally move things around in your life so that you uh, let the joy back in. It really does feel like... It sort of felt like more like a metaphor as I was saying it. It's time to sort of, you know, decorate your life however feels right for you and and let the light in is what I'll keep wanting to say. Outcome. Uh, it's sort of don't be afraid to sort of let new people in. There's new people coming that are, I feel like a, a, in the beginning they might be a little bit difficult for you to get your head around. But yeah, get to know them, like take your time, get to know them, get more information. I think these people are going to be pretty interesting and special and important in your life. So I mean, sometimes they say like best friends sometimes hate each other when they first meet each other. Uh, I would definitely trust that instinct, but... This person, some people coming in, new people, new new social, uh, new social acquaintances. They're going to be a bit like stoppy, starty. Like uh, this is weird, but uh, there are interesting people coming into your life. Let's pull you a room. What's that? I've got my rune cheat sheet here. It's an X. Where's that? Partners. Love, gifts, fortune. Divine union. Oh, difficult people coming into your life. Interesting. Well, that's divine union, isn't it? Let me know in the comments below about that. Let's pull you one of these.
A time for healing. I hear that. All right, I'm going to take it into the extended. I'll see you there. Pisces. Pisces, right. Let's have a look at you, Pisces. Your overall vibe. Four of Cups. What do you need to know right now? Or what don't you know? Four of Swords in reverse. What can you do about that? Death in reverse. Outcome is excellent. Ten of Pentacles. So your overall vibe is a Four of Cups. I feel like you've been standing still for a long time. It sort of feels like new opportunities are coming your way. And you don't know what to do about that. I would say take it really slowly. Really, really slowly. Just uh, let yourself become acclimatized to that. Just with this, what you don't know. It's just, this. this is like a time to recharge, time to, you know, stop fighting the path do you find yourself like you keep getting sick or something it's like the universe is trying to make you slow down it seems like new opportunities are coming your way i would just say really take them slowly That's what it is. You've been standing still for a long time, but also at the same time, you're just... It's like your wheels are going, but you're not going anywhere. And because of that, you keep getting sick. It's like you're not going in any direction because the universe wants you to stop going in that direction. Just slow down, take a step back and look for the right direction. It's come in, take it slowly. What can you do about it? Stop fighting. Stop fighting the inevitable. And your outcome is great. Ten pentacles. Woo. New beginning. Completion of one cycle. Beginning of another. This is. Let's go back to um. What you don't know. More of swords in reverse. Tell me more about this. a whole lot of tens oh, and a whole lot of tens coming up here it's like rest relax like you're making life hard for yourself take take, take a step back this is the end of what was what's been difficult what you've been fighting against fighting against the the, the flow of the river the tide or whatever Swimming against the flow and uh, pushing yourself so hard and not moving anywhere. I I I sort of want to say like something can help you here. Like uh, I'm sort of seeing a. a a group of people that have similar interests. It's like a like discussion group or something. That's kind of what I'm seeing. People like talking together. It, it's sort of, you know, they're saying two heads are better than one. Like this is like a group helping you through this healing circles they're great and you can sort of go and talk your talk your problems out and, and find a positive uh way through it does look like that i don't know stop fighting it stop fighting so hard when you stop fighting so hard and go with the flow it's just gonna be awesome let's pull you a rune stone 
my cheat sheet. What have we got here? Ooh. Well, this is my cheat sheet. So I'm still learning them. I'm getting there. Where is this one? Oh, yeah, here we go. Rebirth. Persevere. Success. Stagnation. Inactivity. Tensions. It's like you're, it's like you're on a, on a uh, precipice. You could go either way. You can keep fighting against the flow of the river and, and, and not move anywhere. Or you can go with the flow. I know what you need to be doing. It's, it makes a lot of sense to me. If you want to take this in six tenders, I'll see you there in a minute. Let's pull you one more card. A win-win outcome is forecast. Oh, yeah. See you later.